So obviously, um, you went together, like, you know, QPR. So what time did both of you got signed? I think it was year three or year four. It was year... Uh, well, I signed for QPR when I was nine. Yeah, nine. Yeah, yeah. so, yeah. So it would have been, yeah, year three. Yeah. Year, year three is like, what, eight and nine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so basically, the you youngest know. you can go to academy, basically, mm-hmm. football. Yeah, yeah. so um, was there any other teams that... You know, so, yeah, obviously, I think us, we was at Afro Soccer and then our coach was Roy, yeah. and I think he had like a strong link with Charlton. Yeah. So he used to take us Charlton like development centers quite a lot. Mm. Yeah, if you taught like, like, tournaments, tournaments there. Like so it was like, yeah. that was like a link for us. Mm. But then I think we went to the Belmont, Belmont tournament. Okay. Was, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think I remember them. He used yeah, to play yeah, yeah. all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we went there one day, then me and Taff was like, we were playing together on the same team then. John O'Brien, John O'Brien, yeah. yeah, John Creef as well. Okay, they spotted us too, so they spoke to both of our dads. Mm. They went to the development center in Val Farm. Val Farm, Val Farm, it's a historic pitch. Yeah, I've got that. Oh, it's all coming back now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I've spoken about some ages. Yeah, went there. Okay, yeah. Mm. And then from there, uh, I think it was there for like three, four weeks. Yeah, and you, 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 you went before me. I went before Taff, so. I think it was getting towards the end of the development and then mm. I went I went before Taff. Yeah. Then Taff came after then we ended up going to um, keep you on training ground, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Got signed. Got signed like that, yeah. Mm-hmm. So obviously you going up together, um probably, you know, in the same team you you were playing. Were you always a rep? Right? You were a centre back, no? I was centre back. Yeah, centre back and you were like a midfielder. Number nine, yeah. Number nine, yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I was like, like it goes I'm gonna say number nine, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, so it was like a little ear right up front, you know what I mean? Uh, he's called Eto, man. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You're actually doing that oh, Yeah, so yeah, obviously, yeah. You, you know, you're, you're playing together. So then I think uh, probably Taff was like 11 these times and mm-hmm. he goes to, or what, what do you start hearing around like QPR? Like, are you going to Arsenal or what's happening? Yeah, so. For me, yeah. for me, it was. um. At first, it was Chelsea that came in for me mm-hmm. first, mm-hmm. and it was a Brent game against. I think it was against Ealing. Yeah. And I scored a free kick. I remember after that game, one guy came up to my dad and gave me the, uh, the Chelsea mm-hmm. card. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, card, yeah. yeah he gave me the card. Um, but my dad was like, "Nah, he he, he wanted Arsenal to come." My dad okay. was fixated on Arsenal. Really? Yeah. Well, what was his whole? You know. I think it was that? just he thought that. If I, if I was to go to Arsenal, I mean, just the way Arsenal play and stuff like that, okay, yeah. it'd be the best thing for me to like learn my craft. Yeah. Chelsea were good though. It Chelsea. was, but I think Arsenal yeah. as well was, was more local. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, so, and driving, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. The, the man, isn't it? The mini yeah. bus. Yeah. <laughs> so I think it, it worked out for both of us, but um, Arsenal, I think Arsenal came to a few of the games, mm. I think, uh, for Brent. Um, and that kind of happened randomly, but as soon as yeah. we, we heard that, um, when was it? I think it was, we had a game for Brent. Yeah. It was against um, Barnet. Okay. And that was meant to be kind of the game for me to sign, like for Arsenal. Yeah. You know, but in the end, like I, I was at well, and I ended up running off the pitch, funny enough, because like. I think I. Yeah, it, I'm. I'm, I'm I was not there. I wasn't there. I'm not I wasn't there. I wasn't there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, yeah. 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 I came to Brent later. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and um, yeah, bro, I was, was diarrhea, man. I could just. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest, bro. Like, you know I mean, yeah. I could feel it in my belly, and I just ended up running off the pitch, and then that's when I had to decide to go on trial mm. or stay at QPR because yeah. they, they were offered two years because it was it was around that yeah, time. Yeah. 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 Okay, yeah, makes sense. Yeah, but so. I don't think they knew. Like, well, you, you knew, but everyone mm. else, we had to just kind of keep it. On the lower. So how, how is it like when, you know, you're young and you don't really know what's going on? Obviously, your dad might be holding something back from you, like saying, you know, he's not telling you the whole details and everything that's going on. Is it like, exciting for you? How are you feeling like, when you know that Arsenal are coming in for you? I was excited. I was excited. I was nervous, though, because mm. I knew the standard would be completely different. Yeah, different, yeah. 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 No offence. But no, like obviously Arsenal being being a, a massive club, so for me I knew I knew straight away, yeah. Like if I can get in, it would be great, but I was I was excited and nervous. Yeah, yeah. I mean Yeah, so obviously um 
go over there, you go over there. Aussie still at QPR, been at QPR ever since. Mm-hmm. So, uh, how would you say your progression was uh, going through the stages at QPR? How was it for you? Did yeah. you have trials, tribulations? How was it? So I was I had a crazy, I had a crazy, not crazy ride, but mm. it, it kind of changed a lot in it. So yeah. obviously, um, growing up, I was started off as a winger striker. Yeah. Then it came around under under fourteens. Okay. Then we had a, a coach called Fitz Fitz Roy. Okay. And then he said, "Oh, so I think I think you'd be a decent right back because of your energy and stuff." Yeah. So I tried right back at first, and I was thinking about it, like, yeah, yeah, so oh man, man, he's scoring goals, man. He's scored goals, man. He's yeah. goals doing all this what? stuff. I mean, yeah. Well, why do Why do you think, Why do you think he said that? Yeah, I, don't know, yeah. I, I think maybe because I was a bit smaller as well. Oh yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. So it could have been like that. Mm. Could be like that at the time. Mm. But obviously, me, I I wasn't like a negative kid, so I didn't think. Yeah, this is gonna this is gonna ruin me. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I took the chance. Yeah, yeah. And then once I did that. And the younger in the younger age groups, I was still scoring from right back, still getting forward. So fair enough. Yeah. I I I started to enjoy the position. Yeah. And ever since then, it's just taken off. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I've enjoyed it so much. So how would you say um the club has changed throughout the years? Like, you know, QPR they from the outside anyway. Me personally, I always see QPR as a club where you know they just throw money at players or whatever. So how would you see the transition from? How it was before to now because it must have been when the, the yeah, owners yeah. came in yeah been. definitely obviously uh back then when all, all that financial stuff i was very i was younger yeah, yeah. so like, i'm growing up just seeing it seeing it from the outside but particularly in the past i say four years i've been like with the first team yeah yeah so i've seen like the club are really trying to push through young players oh now they're trying yeah, to yeah, from yeah, the good. academy getting mm-hmm. players from elsewhere bringing them in yeah, yeah. Young, younger players trying to make us jail so it's definitely a, a, a team, a club that's want to yeah. progress right about, yeah. Yeah, because mm-hmm. they always had a stigma, like, they don't push through younger players. But now I see, you know, you've got um, uh, Barry yes, yeah. doing well. So, mm-hmm. yeah, um, it seems like it's changing a bit. You two played with uh, somebody everybody knows from this area, from London, from England, <laughs> from Spain, Germany, yeah. Japan. Obviously, well, James, well, yeah, well, well, well. Raheem, Raheem Sterling. So, yeah. explain like what he meant to you, you know, growing up watching him just do his thing. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll definitely say something on that. Um, with Raheem, it was just from he was someone where you could definitely bet that he was gonna make it. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, if yeah. You, I mean, you, I, I believed that this guy was gonna make <laughs> it. Well, well, you take it out, like well, yeah, well, just, well, you just knew like. From because he was playing up from, yeah, from yeah. early early yeah. days, um, but Raheem, I mean, at the start, I can remember the first day I met him. Mm. I think I don't know if it was picture day or something like that. Okay. But he basically was um, like I remember stretching on the ground. Joking around, probably. Yeah, yeah. he's called me over. He's like, he's like, hey, he's like, Jelly, come in. <laughs> <laughs> so 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 I've gone over to him, and he's like, told me to lay down on the ground. Mm. So lay down on the ground. Like lifted up my arms and then he's like he's put my hands to the ground slowly and it kind of gives you an effect of like falling through the ground <laughs> and literally it was after that that we we started talking yeah, yeah. um and obviously i used to like my dad used to pick up osman yeah and then we go off to training yeah and then a couple of times we, we drive past um raheem and uh what's his name uh ishmael ishmael oh yeah. ishmael yeah yeah and that's when we started yeah, uh, to pick up raheem to pick them up. okay and makes ishmael. Sense. But yeah. um yeah, obviously where Raheem is now It's crazy man. It's just yeah. it for me it's like if he can if he can get there, like why can't why can't we? Mm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes sense, makes sense. Yeah, that's true. Um what so you said you always knew that he was gonna, you know, blow up and everything like that. Yeah. Did you think that you would end up staying at QPR or do you think nah. that he was always gonna go? I even even my dad, yeah, my dad my dad knows loads about football. First, mm. first day he watched this guy. We was under nine, so he's like under elevens. Yeah. When I watched this guy, he's like, this guy's gonna be better than Ronaldo. <laughs> he, he told me that straight. I was just laughing. <laughs> Which Ronaldo? Uh, Cristiano. Cristiano. Like, yeah, what? Cristiano. Because this one, Cristiano was like, huh. Yeah, yeah. He said, he said that, and then I was like, wow, look at him now. I'm yeah, telling yeah. you, that yeah, he's like, people, people don't, people don't believe us when we say yeah, that. Yeah. We're fully nerd, yeah. But I'm telling you. He's special, man. Yeah, He's special. Man. Like, 
box so many times I've seen him like just even kick a box or whatever just yeah. just, just story, the city, story. Yeah. he used to yeah. run past everyone yeah, <laughs> yeah. there's so, there's oh. so many stories even days of that you go pan into rec yeah. mm. I mean just kick a box there that just, uh, there's two there's two there's too many yeah. I remember even one time he was in um, he came to our church okay so after church like the way everything was set up like we could just kick around in, yeah. you know, in Tabo and I must have got on the ball and he's like proper bars me hard yeah so I was mad did it like <laughs> yeah. kind of half crying and then yeah. <laughs> every, every time you got on the ball I tried to like run yeah. full pace and just go boom but he's just he's, too strong, he's strong bro. Bro. <laughs> that's what people don't realise I don't understand like how where does he get his strength from I don't really get bro. do you know what though from early he, he didn't eat things like chips and that right, really yeah, yeah that's from early what, where do you think he got that from his parents yeah, or his yeah. home yeah because he oh, knows really? he's the eating like he does with us no he does he bro Fair enough, man. It shows it pays off, innit? You know what I mean? We had, we had the, the, the walk in, um, the ready salt in. Like, <laughs> the Chris Walker, the Chris. Or, 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 or the apple. We'd have an <laughs> apple from uh, Mark's dad. After the game. After the game. That's your ready salt in Chris and the apple. Uh, or the one that you just peel <laughs> up the salt. <laughs> 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 the salt in the yeah. back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You used to slap that one. Yeah. Oh, that oh, is. Yeah, that's funny, man. All the time. Mm-hmm. Oh, so, right. what, what would you um make of just what he's doing now, what you expected, what he's be doing now, like literally, like he's in conversations last season for like Ballon d'Or team of the year nah. and stuff like that. I didn't, I didn't expect that. Yeah. It has gone past my expectations. I knew he was yeah. gonna make it and yeah, be yeah. A, yeah. a big player, but he's 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 gone further beyond that. Yeah, definitely. But I think when he when I watched him at Liverpool, the way he was progressing there, then when he got the move to City. Yeah, I, I, knew, I, knew, I knew he's gone. He's, yeah, gone. Yeah, yeah. he's gonna become sad. Yeah. But he's just he's excelled a lot. His game's improved a lot, so yeah. yeah, it's crazy, man. Yeah, under Pep Guardiola, like, he just really like, took off, man. He's, yeah. he's, a, he's an inspiration, man, because of like, yeah. all of us, man. We, we used exactly, to, yeah. We did. We used to see him for Brent as well. Yeah, you know exactly. Like, people, yeah, yeah. people just see him for keep you up. Exactly. Yeah. Used to see him for bar. Yeah, for bar. Youth game. Yeah. Yeah. There's more to it, man. Yeah. Mm-hmm.